down 3-1 at one point. We won in Detroit. We stayed alive in Cleveland. We're back in the Palace. Game 7. I'll be right back. As the playoffs continue, the action intensifies. Eight teams eliminated, and now the true contenders begin to emerge. Nothing can be taken for granted, and those not ready for the next level will be the next to go. This is round two of the NBA playoffs. Welcome to the Palace in Auburn Hills. It will be your Eastern Conference semifinals matchup game seven. The Cleveland Cavaliers facing off against the Detroit Pistons. Chris Paul and Kyrie Irving make a dangerous tandem at point guard. Even though Kyrie doesn't start for whatever reason, they don't put him at the two, nothing, they just whatever. Here goes the opening tip. Drummond versus Vergeau, and it is won by the Pistons, and Monroe will take it up. And it is stolen away immediately by Tristan Thompson. And Thompson, he's taking it, driving left. Passes it to Varejao, who tries to post up, and that's a reach-in foul. Pistons get the ball back. Gerald Green, 4-3. Gets it even with the contested hand in the face. Pistons have a one-point lead early on. Chris Paul versus Brandon Knight. Trey Burke is out due to injury, and that is a huge factor for this Pistons team. Brandon Knight taking it up. Leave him open. He's going to hit one in the or mouth. Brandon Knight, the best three-point shooter this season, shooting almost 50%. And he's just proven it every single game this season. Into Monroe, and one! Gets fouled on the easy layup, and Monroe, he'll convert. Knight has it, kicks it out to Gerald Green, who pump fakes, moves right, out back to Knight, 4-3, and Brandon Knight is just so solid. Dion Waiters has it being guarded by Monroe. He's going to step back. Waiters driving. Lane. Layup at the buzzer on the shot clock. Great layup by Dion Waiters. Andre Blatch for three? He's going to hit another one. The Pistons are hot from three-point land. Five for six to start this game off. The Pistons are one of those teams that they play to the scheme of the opposing team. Burke is hurt, but he's going to get a little bit of playing time. We need him in. Depends on the team that we're playing. If we're playing a team like the Miami Heat, we'll work post. We'll also shoot some threes and we'll work some mid-game, you know, but a lot of post play because the Heat are definitely weak there. But a team against the Cavs, who just seem they have no transition defense aside from Chris Paul, might as well take advantage of it, especially because they're in a slower lineup than we have. Beautiful, beautiful spin layup by Trey Burke. Wayne Ellington against Mikal Piatris. Takes the contested shot and hits it over Piatris. That does not happen often. Great shot by Ellington trying to keep the Cavaliers in this ballgame. Gives it out to Kyrie. Brandon Knight, six points, four assists already. It's stolen away by Knight. Knight alley-oops it to Eurepko, who lays it in. Doesn't do the dunk, just does a simple little finger roll. I'll take it. Rebounded by Hardaway Jr. Timmy out to Andre Miller. Miller spins, fader, off the mark, rebounded by Monroe, put back, great put back by Greg Monroe, five points and four boards early on, Drummond already has six rebounds, Kyrie guarded by Brandon Bass, Cavaliers had a great season and actually beat us in the season series, it's stolen by Bass, up to Pietris, Pietris tonight, leave him open, he'll hit a three, yes, he will. Brandon Knight on fire to start this game off. At half, it's 46-33. The Pistons up by 13. They are two quarters away from advancing on to the Eastern Conference Finals. Kyrie, uh, Chris Paul has it, kicks it to Waiters. Waiters, he's driving with it. He's going to pass out of his shot to G. Stolen by Gerald Green. Green running. Spins, dunks it down. What a spin dunk. What? He was pretty much alone, but what a play by Gerald Green. Very fancy dunk. Kicks it to Drummond from the elbow. No good. Rebounded by Knight. Doing everything. Gerald Green from the charity stripe. Hits it. 13 points for Gerald Green. Drummond, four points. Gives it out to Knight. Top three. 
and Brandon Knight doing everything he can to will this team to victory without Trey Burke, and it's paying major dividends into JJ. It is stolen, no, it's recovered. Monroe has it, fouled, and won again. Alex Len can't stop him. Brandon Knight step back three from the corner. Money, every single time. 15 points, four boards, seven assists for Knight. Paul has it, up to Verjo, who misses the alley-oop dunk. He was alone, the easiest dunk you could possibly have and he can't get it. Seth Curry for three, he's a spot up master. And the Pistons are up by 22. 22 point lead because the Cavaliers have gone ice cold. Brandon Knight has it. Knight driving with it, inside, gives it to Monroe, fouled. And one again. His third and one. This one, the foul's on Thompson. And Brandon Knight gives it to Monroe. Baseline as the shot clock expires and he hits it again. Really contested shot, but Monroe hits it. It's a 20 point Pistons lead. Eight seconds left in the third quarter of play. Andre Miller has it. Miller to Hardaway Jr. To Green in the corner for three. That is so, so good. Gerald Green, late acquisition in the uh, in the middle of the season, actually. We picked him up at a free agency. He's the Birdman of our group. He provides that energy, that dunking presence. He can get some rebounds and just absolutely phenomenal talent to have. Chris Paul taking up the court knowing that his season will be over if he can't overcome this 18-point deficit soon. He's going to throw it across court. It's stolen away by Green. Up to Knight. Knight puts it down with the one-handed jam. 81-65 now, Drummond in the post, working on Verjao. He's gonna spin off. He's gonna kick it out to Knight for three. Brandon Knight, playing like Danny Green and Gary Neal had a love child, and he is just raining threes. Alonzo G to Andre Miller. G, drive in, and he posterizes. Wow, Andre Blatch got posterized by Alonzo G. Brandon Knight is on fire. Step back deep two. Gets another one. 24 points for Brandon Knight and 11 assists. Chris Paul taking it up the court himself. Gives it to G. He's blocked by, I believe, Tim Hardaway Jr. Brandon Knight has it up to green. Puts it down with two hands. And the Pistons are rolling. 90 to 71. Knight for three. In and out. Rebounded by Monroe. Monroe out to Knight. Knight back to Monroe. Jumper hits another one. 14 points for Monroe, seven boards. Brandon Bass, he misses the mid-range shot. Very unlikely of him to do. But Alex Len, he'll put it down, but this game is all but over. Pistons with a 15-point lead, now 12. JJ, layup, and that will be your ball game. The final score is 96-82. The Detroit Pistons will go on to face the Miami Heat. In the Eastern Conference semifinals, big shocker there, Heat there. But we were 4-0 against the Miami Heat this season. We were 0-4 against the team that the Heat beat, the Chicago Bulls. So is this a blessing in disguise? We'll have to wait and find out. Can LeBron James overpower Brandon Knight and Monroe, the two stars from this squad? 6 for 8 from 3. Knight 9 for 15, shooting 13 boards, uh, 13 points. Uh, oh my God, 13 assists. Four boards, 24 points, one steal, no turnovers. Andre Miller didn't have the best game. Monroe, three blocks, seven boards. Uh, I think I said two steals. And that's their team. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to take a look at the rest of the stat line on your way out. Dion Waiters was 10 for 14 with 25 points. Had a great game. I hope you guys enjoyed. Miami Heat versus the Pistons. Coming soon. I'm Moonlight Swami, and I'll be talking to you guys later. Peace. I'm out.